Well, today the Fox right. 35 Care Force honoring those who have fought for our freedom, of course, but the brave heroes uh, with so many incredible qualities uh, from what we can learn as well. And we're joined now by former U.S. Marine and author Eric Ripmeyer. Eric, great to see you. Good to see you on this Veterans Day. Likewise, Ryan. Thanks for having me back. I got to say, happy birthday to my Marines. Yesterday was our birthday. Hoorah, Semper Fi Marines. Absolutely. Well said for sure. What is it about our veterans that you think is so critical in this current time? You know what you get with a veteran, Ryan? You're getting commitment, integrity, accountability, loyalty. It's this service before self mentality. You know what you get. It doesn't matter. We all bleed green. It doesn't matter what branch it was. We all raised that right hand. We all swore to defend that flag. We have that common thread. We have that fabric that brings us back. I call it like home base. When you're kids, you play tag, right? But the big oak tree is home base. In the military, we have that home base. We have a mission at hand. We love each other. We respect each other. We love that flag. You know, and Eric, obviously we focus on veterans at many days and what they've done for our country, but I know you feel there are a lot of things that veterans do differently that we could all learn from in our everyday lives. Yeah, they sure do, Ryan. I mean, there's so many skills that transfer over, and here's the crazy thing, believe it or not, just 0.4% of our population are active duty right now. 7.3% are veterans. When you have a veteran, when you bring them into your workforce, and when you bring and put them out in the regular civilian society, you, again, you have all these core traits you get, and I would say probably at the, at the most important part of it is the unity. It's the sense of togetherness, the camaraderie. You know, we all have that. We all bleed that green, like I said. So when you bring them in, you know that you have somebody that's going to unify, going to bring people together, and it's all all about putting the mission first. What are some of the messages? If you want someone to take one thing away from what can we do on Veterans Day or what can we learn from a veteran, what would that be? I think it's the sacrifice piece, Ryan. I think that's what everybody needs to recognize. We have a society right now that you know, if you want to find a date, swipe right. If you want to ride to the mall, swipe right. You have to remember that, you know, this, this gener the generations prior, it wasn't that way. You had people that were actually falsifying their age to say they were older so they could go serve. So it's a totally different mindset. I'd say at the core of that would be just the appreciation and understanding that what we have right now isn't free. Lots of people paid the ultimate price to have the luxuries that we have. Oh boy, so true. Uh, Eric, thanks for the message this morning. Always good to see you, but especially on this Veterans Day. Likewise, Ryan. Thank you for having me, sir. I appreciate it. We have got a full list, by the way, the businesses that are giving deals and discounts to veterans. We talk about that a lot of the active duty service members. If you want to look for that, just go to fox35orlando.com. I know a lot of veterans will get free meals today and very deserve it on that front as well. Well, coming up this morning on Good Deal, our special Fox 35 Care.